It was a sea of purple inside the courtroom. Not only Sierra's family wearing her favorite color, but also members of the courthouse staff and community members. Also, we saw members of the jury in the courtroom as well. And this was a much more lengthy sentencing hearing than anybody could have expected and much more emotional, especially when James Worley decided to speak directly to the family. This is James Worley as he was walking into the courtroom. He asked the judge to speak before being sentenced. That speech lasting 45 minutes. Worley faced the family proclaiming his innocence and seemed to have an excuse for all of the evidence stacked against him. But after listening for some time, Worley said he had love in his heart for the Joggin family and tried to explain that he felt terrible for them. Sierra's grandfather got up and walked out and the rest of the family followed. Many sobbing, others showing faces full of anger and rage. Here's a portion of what James Worley's statement was. Their hearts are wounded and they always will be. But if you believe what I find, I believe that Sierra goes on. She may have been murdered and victimized, but she goes on. The judge set James Worley's death date for June 13th of 2019, but of course, that's a date that will not happen. This could go on for several years, and James Worley already did say that he does plan to appeal this. Reporting tonight from Fulton County, Michelle Zapata, WTOL 11.